It's Mike with Iceberg Gaming, and today's World of Warcraft gold making guide video. I'm going to be showing you guys how to quote unquote double your gold per hour on your farms. Now, this is a little bit of hyperbole, so don't take the double number seriously, but we are going to dramatically increase our gold per hour with this method. But real quick, before we get into that, today's video is sponsored by Catapult and Turbo Sloths. Become the new star of the Wasteland League. Pimp your turbo junk, set up powerful booster, stock up on active gas, and go ahead, show what speed is. Turbo Sloth is a whole new racing universe. In this universe, your primary objective is to use a powerful turbine to make your multi-ton clumsy truck become as fast as a bolt of lightning. Give your turbo junk some decent upgrades, install boosters, stock up on gas, customize, uh, customize every part and component, and rush ahead, show off the true speed. You are to enter the incredible Wasteland League and prove that you are the one, the madman of speed. With a unique atmosphere, pristine graphics, and red hot metal are waiting for you, for you in Turbo Sloths. Now that the bills are paid, let's get into the gold making. Step one on this method is to park a character at this location behind the Sulfurian Spire in Mount Hygel on Kalimdor. Now what you're going to do is you're going to kill these Molten Giants over here. They respawn every six or seven minutes and they have a very high drop rate of Volatile Fire. So basically we're just going to go ahead and kill them all. And then we are going to go back to whatever you were farming before. Say, for example, if you're farming Manitoons, you will do a few runs of Manitoons, switch over, kill these giants, and then log back over. Now, you make sure make sure you have a potion of treasure finding running because these are Cataclysm monsters, so they will give you tiny treasure chests. Make sure you kill the named one over there first. He is a quest guy, so he will respawn by the time you're done killing everything else. King Moltron. And that is it. While you're in the area, make sure you check for this chest by Gar. You can get some great stuff from it that is worth quite a bit of gold. Also, while you are in the area, make sure you check for this rare mob, Gar. He also drops some really valuable stuff. He's not up very often, but it's worth checking. He's usually to the west in the little snowy or ash area, whatever it is. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit that like button. Any questions in the comment section, make sure you're subscribed so you get more tips like this. And don't forget to join me on Twitch. Twitch streaming will be starting soon. And if I can figure out how to do it, I'll be streaming on YouTube as well. Thank you so much.